Hello everybody. Uh, it's real early in the morning. I just woke up, but I wanted to talk about this game, Red Eclipse. I forget how I found out about it. Doesn't really matter. Um, but it's a game if you've ever heard of Cube 2, which is like this Quake-like video game engine with a built-in editor. It's pretty neat. It's a total conversion based off of that old, uh, that old, I don't even know, but it's based off of that. So I'm going to show it off a little bit here. I'm going to show off the editing part because I made something pretty neat. Nav map here. So let's look at my nav map that I made because I'm Navjack. Okay, so let's enter editor mode and I'll uh, give a little walkthrough. I just kind of crudely recreated a uh, house I just moved into in uh, this engine. Oh, game. Really, not engine. Go upstairs. And we're going to go to my room. And we're going to go to where I'm sitting right now. And my computer would be right here with a table that's going like this. Except I haven't done that yet. But the editor is really cool. I, li I like games with editors because I like tinkering with stuff. Like if you want to edit stuff, like let's go in this, the, the front room of the house. You have uh, the mouse cursor, and you see it's like a little grid. You could left click, and it'll select. And once you have a part selected, you just mouse wheel, and it'll extrude it. If you need to um, like do the corners, I right, hit the wrong button. If you need to do the corners, you hold down Q look over at a corner and then you're making little spiky bits and then you could bring them right back up it's really intuitive is and easy to use but editor is only one part of it I actually started playing the game finally so let's play online see if people are playing now we got one person playing one person Discard my changes here. Yeah, I was like playing this last night, and there was like maybe, uh, must have been like six people. Maybe it got up to eight people, and it was a blast. It's a really fun game. It's like fast paced. You jump around. You could like do drop kicks through the air while you're running around. You could double jump for a boost, kind of thing. I think maybe actually I'll um, disconnect and offline practice. Uh, let's do capture a flag on a random map. And there's also mutators, kind of like um, uh, Unreal Tournament, I guess, which are pretty nice. So this is the game. You got I have to run random weapons for me because there's like loadouts. The bots are kind of good. They're just shooting through the walls right now, it looks like. And you could double tap to do like a dodge kind of move. There's... Whoa, there's alt fire for all the guns. There's, like, here, let's check out. So it's like the machine gun kind of thing. But it shoots, like, a flak. I would call that flak. The pistol? I don't know. I, I guess it, maybe it's like it shoots with more power. I don't know. You get little items. You throw stuff. And this is the drop kick. I think it, I just figured it out, but it's just like shift and jump. Woo! And you, and it does damage, which is always cool.
And there you go. So I'm going to return our flag real quick here. But anyway, yeah, I just wanted to make a quick video showing this game because it is really cool. I'll put a link uh, in the description uh, where you can get it. Play it. It's fun. Edit your own map. Make a recreation in your house. I'll uh, see you guys later.